guys, Shadebird1000 here, and... Monkey! Monkey1000, don't forget to check our channel out. What are we doing? What do we got? We were on an adventure today. We went on an adventure, right up the road from us. Mm-hmm. And we found some goodies. We found some goodies, some uh, flea market finds. I'll put it under our yard sale finds. But this is, uh, some of it's selling stuff, some of it's keeping stuff. And you'll see what I mean here in a minute. Shall we show them? Sure. All right. All right, first thing, we got this. I got this for my homemade stove that I'm building out of the propane tank. So I got that, he gave that to me. I got this, weed eater. Uh, someone has drained the gas out of it, which is good because I look down in, the fuel lines are still pliable, they're still rubbery, so they're not. I looked inside, everything looks good. This will probably fire right up, I think. We got this little grill here, it's kind of like a little hibachi. It looks like it was only used maybe once, maybe twice. Uh, we don't know. We may end up keeping that. I don't know. This thing, I got this. It needs a blade. It is missing a blade, and he said there was something else, uh, some kind of issue, but he said it will run. So I'm not sure what's going on with that. It's not locked up. I'll bet it'll run. It's a Briggs and Stratton engine, Troy built, 21 inch, self propelled. So, um, there is no bagger with it, but it is a mulching mower. <clears throat> so, we'll, we'll do some tinkering around with that, see what it needs, if it's worth fixing, or if I just sell it for parts, you know. Right. Okay. Also got, <laughs> finally got me a meat cutting knife, an electric knife. So, I got that. We also have this here. This is one of those, you know, Coleman stoves. Still got fuel in it. We will do a thing on this. A, uh, whatever you call it. <laughs> Not really a review because I love them, but we'll uh, check it out. We'll do a video on this together. Make sure it works. I'm sure it does. So, you know, we're looking at Hell, I'd probably get 25 for that weed eater. It's a home light. I'll probably put 40, I'll take 30 for it. Yeah. It's a works. home light. So, that thing, yeah, I mean, so, and then, you know, I can get 25, 20 to 25 out of these, what they're going for. Now, my keeping stuff. <laughs> we got this little cheap. Just a cheap little That's camera. Cute, it is cute. Is it it's a flip thing, like? it. It was probably no. I don't even think it, the the. No, see, it doesn't flip around. But you guys know how I am with cameras. It's just a battery. You put batteries in it. Mm -hmm. It does have a memory card in. I'm kind of anxious to see what it's got on it. Mm -hmm. But uh, you know, just like I said, it's probably it was probably eight or ten bucks new. Yeah. But that's okay. I mean, I, I love cameras because that. When I tell you what I gave for all this stuff, you'll see why. We also, <laughs> this is a keeping item here. RCA. Like I said, I don't know if it works or not, but hell, the bag's decent. It needs cleaned up. Big battery. Yeah, eight millimeter is what that is. There's a tape right there. If that works, I might be able to run my tape on it. I don't know. I can't remember. It does have a remote control with it. It's got the cables. The charger. Still got the book with it. Another tape. There's the battery. These batteries, you know, they don't... They're probably shit. But that's okay. Because these things, you know, you can plug in right there. You plug it in right there on onto that. And you can use it with this. You plug your end here from there and plug it into there and you can use it. But we'll have to see if it works. Okay. So there's that. And this, my third behemoth. Is that me? Me. My third behemoth. It's an RCA. Check this old thing out. Another old shoulder. You put it on your shoulder. There's, there's the mic and your slide out you know for your your viewfinder uh, 
like I said, I don't know if it works. I don't care if it works or not. I just, you know, you guys know me. I, I love these things. Um, you know, it's got two batteries with it, which you can tell. See how green that is? It's, they're probably no good. Is this zoomed out? Um, I don't know if it works or not. This is the same way. You can plug into here and then into that, which is the charger slash right here. This is the charger. Um, somewhere, where is it? You can charge two batteries at once, but you can plug in. I'm not sure about on this one. Uh, but anyway, we'll, we're going to make a video on this too. But you can plug, same way with that, you plug it in there just like this one, and you can operate it that way but it will charge two batteries at once I believe this one you can also oh no okay you plug this actually into that and use it as electric uh, we'll go over that when we check it out so anyway that's what we got for resale um, just off of this and this I will make money on it um, so this, even if I sell it for parts, you know, that's a Troy bill. There's a lot of good parts on that. Even, you know, like if, if the transmission's out of the self-propelled, you know, uh, you're not going to want to put money into it. But someone may have one of these that, that needs parts, needs wheels. These wheels and tires always go bad. You know, I could get... 2025 out of that just just for parts so anyway that's what we got and um, that's our little haul uh, it's a guy private private guy um, we went and uh, made a video about a year ago on an abandoned place right up the road up here um, he's got it he's got a bunch of cars old cars 41 uh, 49 uh, 50 something Continental not the Lincoln Continental it's just a Continental they only made 600 of them he's got a 59 I forget what it is a Plymouth of some sorts but um, all complete cars but anyway that's our haul I gave you 50 bucks for it all so you know like I said just this and this is going to pay for it and like I said keeping items to me it was worth the 50 bucks whether these cameras work or not I don't care I just like them um, but I bet they will you know so oh, that closed earlier it's just fine so anyway um, yeah there we go that's what we got so I've got a couple treasures these are my treasures here so and like I said this this he just gave to me, so that'll go to the stove. I'm going to, I'll sell the stove once it's finished, and uh, I'm sure somebody buy that stove. I'd probably get uh, 20, 30 bucks. A lot of people want more, but I'm thinking 20, 30 bucks, and they can have the stove. But so you know, that's going to help me make a little money. That which we may this weekend, if I got time, we may hook it up to the stove and and fire up the stove. I may have cut the hole too big in the stove but we'll have to i think i did but we'll have to see i can fix that that's no big deal i'll just get a reducer but anyway this is what these are my items here so yeah we did all right i can make a little money on that so i'm thinking all together um i'll probably turn about a 30 40 dollar profit on it on this stuff so that's pretty cool so there you guys go another yard sale fine and uh, I gotta go. We gotta go get the vet. It got here, so we gotta go get it covered up. And um, I want to check out these cameras. Um, maybe we'll just uh, check them all together on video. All right, how's that sound? Okay, guys, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Monkey's on the phone. So I'm gonna say Shea Bear, the myth, the man, legend. I'm gone for now. Uh, Bruno, <laughs> Bruno thought he was going for a ride. Hi, buddy. <laughs> Seems smiling. Hi, buddy. <laughs> He's happy, puppy. You happy, puppy. 
<laughs> yes, you are. He got to go with mommy today for a while when they went to go get the vet. So, all right, guys, I appreciate it. Shea Bear, the myth, the man, the legend, I'm gone for now. Stay tuned for some more awesome videos like this one. So, be sure to click the bell icon. Get notified of these awesome videos. All right, bye bye, guys. Uh, we're halfway through the week. <laughs> Almost there. We'll see you guys. Bye bye.